Hi there. If, like me, you've always been interested in how chatbots work, there's a really easy way to be able to create your own chatbot just using Google Forms. Let's take a look. So here we are on phobie.io, which is a great way of creating chatbots using Google Forms. If you've already got a Google Form you'd like to use, you can just paste the long form link in here to create your bot, or they'll even give you a link to go and create one for yourself. So I'm going to do just that now. So we're going to create ourselves a question. And I'm just going to call this one chatbot demo. Okay. I'm not going to put any description in there because I don't think I need to. For the chatbot to work, you can't have required questions. But what we're going to put in here is um, basically, please tell us your name. Okay, and we make that uh, short answer question. And then I'm going to say, please provide a valid email address. Contact you. Uh, and again, make sure it's not a required question. You can use response validation though to make sure that if it is text, that it does contain uh, a regular email address, okay? And then you might want to ask a question. So for example, um, what is your uh, issue? And this might be for something like a um, call logging kind of approach. So I'm gonna give it multiple choice. And it, my options are going to be um, remote learning advice and um, technical advice or a technical issue requiring support. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to make that. And then I'm going to make an extra um, section or two sections come to that. So we're going to have the first section, which is going to be remote learning. I'm going to add a question to it, which is just going to be, please describe the um, issue you are facing and make that a paragraph. And on the other one, which is going to be technical, I'm going to add a question again. And what are your issues? Okay and just make sure they're not required questions there. So we make it paragraph, there's a section, make sure that one's not a required question. And then we come back to this one and we send them to form um, based on the question answer. So learning advice is gonna to go to remote learning, uh, technical issue, it's gonna to go to technical, technical issues. Uh, and then, so after here, after section one, we go based on our choices. This one then is going to take us to submit form and this one will take us there. So we've got our chatbot demo. We go up to the send button and we can collect the email address. Use the long link for this. Uh, not the email address, the, the URL link, sorry. Use the long link. And then we come back to phobie.io, paste our link in there and create our bot. So here's my bot. And they've even got a bot to help you build the rest of it. Okay. So we can add an opening message. Hi there. Then it says, please, please tell us your name. Um, and we can add a message. Thanks for getting in touch. Then it will ask them to provide an email address. Then we can say, thanks for that. So it's just like a little proper chat bot. Now we've got a bro hunting form. We can say, thanks. Let's gather some information on your issues. Okay, so that's going to take them to there. Jumps around a little bit, sorry. Let's gather some information. We get the information. We're going to describe and we're going to say thanks. One of our remote learning team will respond as soon as possible. And then we're just going to copy that one. 
And down to the next one, technical issues, what are your issues? Uh, thanks. Copy that in. Oop, I did that. And we're going to take that out. One of our IT support team will be in touch as soon as possible. And then we go, um, pleasant talking to you. And I'm going to add my email so that it knows who to send the responses to. So now I'm going to create my bot. And there we go. We can try our bot out before we do anything with it. So here it is working. So I type in here my name, click send. Okay, uh, all right, let me give you a, a valid email address. There we go, add that in there. Thanks for that, what's your issue? Um, I'm, I would like some remote learning advice. Okay, so we've got to describe the issue we're facing. Um, we are finding it's hard to manage all the screen time with the family, for example. Okay. And there we go. We've got a little chat book working. So there we go. We've completed our little chat bot. And then at our end, what we're going to see if we close that is obviously the responses coming through into Google Forms. So they sit in here ready for us and we can obviously turn on our notifications as we need to or you can do that within your google sheet as well and then finally one of the really cool things you can do is you can share the link but you can also embed your chat bot as a pop-up or using iframe so for example in this case we can just click here we can customize by color, however we want, and by size. And then we can just copy the embed code, take that to a Google site. Okay, I'm just going to start a new site just for this purpose. And then all I need to do on here is take the embed code and drop it in. And it will add a little chat button wherever we want it on the page. And you can scroll down and here you will see right at the bottom of the page, a little chat bot icon, which we can pop up and start to fill in. So it works really brilliantly.